Through the valiant efforts of the Imperial and Volunteer Forces, Zhang Jiao, founder of the Way of Peace, is defeated. The Yellow Turban Rebellion is ended. But the longed-for peace did not return. At the capital of Luoyang, the eunuchs faced off against the faction made up of the relatives of the Emperor. Using this as an excuse, Yuan Chao and others raid the Imperial Palace, killing the eunuchs. Under cover of this confusion, Dong Zhuo of Xilian leads his forces to the capital. He seizes control of the Emperor, appoints himself Prime Minister, and proceeds to take control and to tyrannize the country. The Lords soon began to feel themselves in danger. Hmm. All right. Here, everyone prepare to defend this spot. You are master, Leo Bei, are you not? I have heard all about your exploits in defeating the Yellow Turbans. The thing is, I have a task that would be perfect for a brave warrior such as yourself. I haven't been able to find anyone capable of it yet but I feel like us meeting here is somehow fated. Will you listen to what I have to say? Oh, thank you so much. This is a very delicate matter. Could you come a little closer? The fact of the matter is that there is a small group of us who have put in motion a secret plan to eliminate a certain individual. The man who has taken on the noble duty of carrying out this plan is none other than the famed warrior Master Cao Cao. We gave him a sword and sent him off to Luo Yun, but the problem is he hasn't come back. That's where you come in. We'd like you to sneak into Luo Yun and see what's going on. I could go myself, but the castle there has become a dangerous place recently. Depending on Lord Dong Zhuo's moods, innocent bystanders can be beheaded with barely a moment's notice. It's not really the place for a weak old man like myself anymore. It will be dangerous, but will you accept this mission to go inside the castle at Luo Yong? and find Master Cao Cao? Please, we are all counting on you. Dong Zhuo's palace is guarded by Zhang Liao. Be careful not to be spotted when you are searching inside. Yes. 
I've got some great stuff here. I appreciate your business. Oh, are you a hunter? It looks like you've caught yourself an impressive quarry. I myself am not much of a hunter, but I do like to look at what others bring back. Show me what you catch and I'll reward you well. I've got some great stuff here. I appreciate your business. What can I get for you? Please, come again. Welcome, welcome. Do please come again. Hey, get on in here. Come again. You need a horse? I'll be supporting you. Sit. Brother. Thank you.
Welcome, welcome! Do please come again. Thank you. Excuse me!
I was pretty dangerous in the past, but then I took an arrow in the knee. Hey, this is no laughing matter. I need medicine or it really hurts. That's great. Thank you. It really does hurt. So please be quick. Ah, this should definitely work. Let me give you some useful information. I know the very best place to get into Luo Young. I used to use it all the time. My old allies might still be found near it. You should try asking one of them. Come <laughs> on. 
I'm having some trouble catching food for the tigers. Could someone possibly help me out? Ah, thank you so much. I'll be counting on you to stop me from becoming cat food. Ah, the food! Thank you so much. Now I can appease the tiger's hunger. You can find tigers in Luo Young too. They are always so aggressive. Maybe you can make use of this then. It will make tigers obey you. Seen any suspicious characters lurking about? Don't let your guard down for an instant. Of course. I will let the others on watch know. Let's see. Again. Liu Bei, was it? Master Cao Cao, what are you doing in a place like this? I don't care who does it! Somebody bring me Cao Cao's head at once! Forgive me, but there is no time for me to explain myself. Come with me! Here, everyone prepare to defend this spot.
form I aspirated. I will fight to the end. Should be safe here. What were you doing back there? Master Wong Yun asked me to search for you, Master Cao Cao. He said you were heading for the palace on some sort of mission. Master Wong Yun sent you? I see. I suppose it's okay if I tell you. I was in the castle in order to assassinate Dong Zhuo. Is that right? Dong Zhuo? He is a poison that is slowly killing off our country. If he is not dealt with immediately, the chaos that started with the Yellow Turbans will grow worse. However, my attempt failed, and I was forced to flee when I came across you. I had no idea. I am leaving Luoyang in order to plot my next move against Dong Zhuo. Liu Bei, if you wish to live, you should probably leave this place as well. My failure is likely to lead to heightened security around Dong Zhuo. You made a name for yourself against the Yellow Turbans. I would watch my back if I were you. Thank you for the warning. Yuan Shao of Ji Province has raised an army to slay Don Zhuo and is requesting our cooperation. Oh, so the noble master Yuan Shao has finally risen up. The true intellect behind Yuan Shao is Cao Cao. I imagine he was the one who actually wrote the letter we received. I imagine. He realized that he did not have the ability to move enough men to his cause himself. So, he decided to use Yuan Shao's name. He is a cunning and devious man. Master Cao Cao, this must have been the plan to defeat Dong Zhuo he talked about in Luoyang. What do you intend to do, my lord? I have no reason to turn them down. Will you accompany me as well? Yes, my lord. It would be an honor if we could go with you. If we defeat Dong Zhuo, whose carnal desires affect the fate of the land, the lives of the people will surely take a turn for the better. Things are not quite that simple, Liu Bei. Dong Zhuo is one reason for the deepening chaos affecting the land. But the real cause is the loss of authority of the Han court. Unless we can restore the pride and control of the Han court, the war plaguing this land will never end. I'm aware of that. But I also believe that this will be a significant first step on that road. If famed warriors from across the land can join forces and remove the evil that is eating away at the heart of the Han imperial court, I would be proud to be a part of that. Yes. For now, we must focus our efforts on slaying Don Zhuo. Liu Bei, I am expecting even greater things from you, and your sworn brothers, than you showed in the battle against the Yellow Turbans. I am ready. <laughs> <laughs> 